Healthcare Center in La Crosse is building multiple new additions as part of a renovation project, allowing them to provide more services. WEAU's Dashiell Menzel has more on how this will benefit residents, workers, and patients. Ground is now broken for a new renovation project at Hillview Healthcare Center. La Crosse County is investing $19.6 million to renovate the existing buildings at Hillview. Campus Administrator Kelly Kramer says there will be plenty of new additions as part of the project. We have the addition of a CBRF beds, assisted living, as well as an intergenerational day center is planned and supportive housing in addition to our nursing home that currently stands today. The addition of over 30 new beds will also provide benefits to the residents at Hillview. One of the biggest changes is all of our rooms will, will now be private rooms. So in the nursing home, most of them are double occupancy. So once this project is complete, um, we will have private rooms for everyone. And that will help not just the residents, but also the staff caring for them. The new intergenerational day center will provide child care as well as programming for older adults with dementia. So many cultures do that and, and we've lost sight of that in the U.S. and, and it's great great to have older adults and adults with special needs being combined with children because everyone grows. La Crosse County Board Chair Tina Trigestad says the $12 million in funding from the American Rescue Plan Act helped move the project forward. The county board spent m months and months deliberating on prioritizing our ARPA funding and this was a culmination of so many of the priorities that the board had, uh, housing and child care and obviously uh, sustainability. The project is expected to be complete by December of 2025. In La Crosse, Dashiell Menzel, WEAU 13 News. Thanks, Dashiell. The project will also include 10 units of housing that will complement the city and county's Pathways Home Plan, which looks to end homelessness in La Crosse.